name is Kevin Casey. Uh, I am a fine artist and I've been doing this for the past nine years and I've just been trying to make a difference, do something different. I don't want to be the same, I want to evolve, constantly trying to evolve, constantly trying to make something that nobody has seen and I think in this world I see a lot of the same stuff and that's what gets the hype which yeah it's frustrating I think it's frustrating for any artist trying to do something different to try to make a difference when people want to stay so stuck in one generation you know change is scary I guess for some people I meditate a lot that's where I get all my inspiration uh, I think sometimes people could get misled and think that drugs create a lot of creativity I mean a lot of idols of musicians or artists or whatever they did a lot of drugs but I kind of want to pave the way for a different modality you know it's not the drugs or it's not you know some sort of substance that can create for an artist it is them but our minds get in the way an artist's mind I can just speak for myself and some of the friends that I have is constantly active it's constantly doing something it's always at work and if it's not directed into the right thing that's I guess that's where self-destructive tendencies come from so I want to show that like evolution comes from within evolution comes from overcoming and mastering my own ego so that it'll allow me to create freely create without limitation and continue to grow and expand I love myself I love who I am I love being creative I love that I have that power but with it comes also a lot of internal chaos at one point in my life I believe that in order to pursue my dream I had to give up a lot of other things that I actually cared about and loved like a sacrifice and I realized like that could have only stemmed because I didn't feel like I deserved really wonderful things and in the same breath it was like my art is is my love but it could be so consuming it can demand all my attention I mean I forget I forget to do basic things sometimes like answer people's text messages or call somebody back because my mind even if I'm not working in my studio or whatnot I'm constantly focused on this ambition this drive to create this new brand new thing it's wonderful and it's like a curse at the same time but I, I wouldn't live my life without it I literally think within like the past three years did I actually develop my own kind of style and technique prior to that I mean I looked at a lot of different artists and that's important it's important to look it's important to get ideas it's important to like recreate some of my favorite paintings but I think taking what I need and leaving the rest is more important than trying to make something like my favorite artist you know it's like it's like they're all in my pocket and i'll pull out what i need from them in order to create something that's originally mine and i don't feel comfortable when someone says your art reminds me of so and so it's like i don't like that but i do love when people say i know your artwork immediately when it shows up in my my instagram feed or but not like that's so satisfying it's so satisfying to know that I'm at this point where you know a Kevin Casey when you see it but that took a lot of practice and then literally it just kind of happened it just kind of happened on its own 
as I continued to strive for it. So I just had to trust that process that, but I always had that internal voice that was kind of like, you gotta do this and you're gonna do this. And there's no stopping you.